It's been 40 years since the Jonestown massacre, the biggest mass murder suicide in modern history. Behind it was this man, Jim Jones, who was the leader of an American Christian cult called People's Temple. It claimed the lives of over 900 people, which included over 300 children. So why did they die? In 1974, Jim Jones moved hundreds of his followers from the US to an isolated Guanese jungle in South America. He leased over 3,800 acres to start a new community, Jonestowns. The followers were cut off from their family members. Four years later, a US congressman, Leo Ryan, organized a delegation of journalists and some concerned relatives to investigate Jonestown. The delegation was approached by at least a dozen cult followers who wanted to return back to the US. On November 18, 1978, as they waited for their flight, a group of temple gunmen opened fire and killed five people, including Congressman Leo Ryan. Meanwhile, Jones told his followers that the community was under threat and urged his followers to drink cyanide-laced punch. Take the portion like they used to take in ancient Greece and step over quietly because we are not committing suicide. It's a revolutionary act. If we can't live in peace, then let's die in peace. Jonestown remains one of the largest single incident of intentional civilian death in American history.